stand at the front of your mat. Take a deep breath in. Let the power of your breath fill your whole body and being. Exhale and be fully present in this moment. We are so blessed. The food we eat, the water we drink, the air we breathe, our earth provides so many gifts for our pleasure and survival. Let's commit to healing ourselves and this planet. Let's nurture our body, nourish our souls, give back to the earth, and live dedicated to the connection that unites us all. You're gonna find your way out onto your backs. Separate your feet mats width apart and let your knees drop inward and place your palms onto your belly. Relax your whole body completely, softening your eyes, your mouth, and any tension in the shoulders. Continue to breathe deep, inhaling and exhaling. And then squeeze your knees into your chest. You're gonna cross your right leg over the left and drop your knees over to the left side. Reach your right arm out and look towards the right arm and inhale deeply and exhale. Relax that right shoulder down onto the floor. Close your eyes and simply breathe. Squeeze both knees into your chest. And let's switch sides. Cross your left leg over the right. Drop your knees to the right. Reach your left arm out. Get a really good stretch through your spine as you look towards your left hand and take a deep breath in. And exhale it out completely. Squeeze both knees back into your chest. You're gonna place the sole of the left foot onto the floor. Grab hold of the right foot and bring it upward towards the ceiling. Slowly begin to pull your right thigh downward towards the floor or the ribcage and breathe. Squeeze your right knee into your chest, place the foot on the floor and switch sides. Left knee in, grab the left foot, inhale the left foot to the ceiling, exhale, pull your left thigh down. Keep inhaling and exhaling, pulling the leg closer towards the floor without bouncing. and then squeeze the knee in, squeeze both knees in. Roll to your right side and come up into a seated position. You're gonna sit up as tall as you can. Place your wrists onto your knees and close your eyes. Ground your sit bones into the floor, lengthen the spine. And take some very deep breaths in and out. Focusing on the quality and the length of each inhale. And exhale. Continue breathing deep. and then place your palms into namaste. We ask, may this practice cleanse and purify so that we can live every moment fully present and aware. May we release all the ways in which we keep ourselves disconnected from our bodies, each other and the earth, and open to the knowing that we are all one. Left hand onto the right knee, bring the right hand behind you. Inhale, lengthen the spine, and exhale, twist. Look out over the right shoulder and breathe deeply as you revolve the spine. Exhale, face forward, switch sides. Right hand on the left knee, left hand behind you. 
Inhale, lift your chest. Exhale and twist. Breathe. And face forward. Place the soles of the feet on the floor. Knees are bent. Cross your left arm in front, right hand behind. Inhale, lift. Exhale, twist. Breathe. Exhale, face forward, switch sides. Right forearm crosses, left hand behind you. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, and twist. Exhale, face forward. You're gonna come out onto all fours. Shoulders over the wrists, knees hips width apart. Press into the palms and inhale, look up and arch. Let the shoulders pull down the back. And exhale, round, tucking in your chin and drawing the tailbone down. Link movement with breath. So you're gonna inhale, look up and arch. Exhale and round. Inhale, look up and arch. Curl your toes under, pressing into your palms, stretch back into downward facing dog, either keeping the knees bent or straightening the legs. Make sure that the foundation is specific. Bone under the index finger presses down, shoulders roll open. Heels descend. And walk your feet to your hands. Inhale, look up and lengthen. Hands onto your hips as you exhale. Inhale, come all the way up to standing. Come into Tadasana. Big toes and ankles together. Ground your legs, tailbone in. Front ribs soft and breathe. Place your palms into Namaste. Inhale, arms reach. Exhale, fold all the way forward, bending your knees only if you need to. Inhale, lengthen the spine forward. Fold on your exhale. And inhale, come on up all the way, pressing the legs straight as the arms reach. And exhale, palms right at the heart. Focus on the breath. Inhale, arms reach. Exhale, fold all the way forward. Keep your legs straight if you can. Inhale, lengthen the spine forward. Exhale, fold. Inhale, come on up all the way. Exhale, palms right at the heart. Sun salutes A. Inhale, arms reach. Exhale, fold all the way forward, hands down at the floor. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, step back. Top of a push-up, hold here and breathe. Then put your knees on the floor, toes away, and lower slow. Inhale, come into cobra, really engage your legs, press the elbows in and the shoulders back. Melt your chest towards your heart as the shoulders pull away. Then exhale, chest down, curl your toes under, and press back into downward facing dog. Check your wrists. Extend and lift your hips off the shoulders and let your heels come downward towards the floor. Breathe. Walk your feet to your hands. Inhale, look up. Exhale, fold. Inhale, come up to stand. Push into the feet, arms reach. Exhale, palms right at the heart. Inhale, arms reach. Exhale, fold. 
Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, step back, top of a push-up. Knees down, toes back, lower. Inhale, cobra. And exhale, downward facing dog. And breathe. Walk your feet to your hands. Inhale, look up and lengthen. Exhale and fold. Inhale, come up all the way. Arms reach. Exhale and palms right at the heart. Inhale, arms reach. Exhale, fold. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, step back, top of a push-up. Either put your knees on the floor or lower Chaturanga Dandasana. Inhale, upward facing dog. Hold, press into the palms. Lift the inner thighs. Draw the shoulders back. Look up. And exhale, downward facing dog. Breathe. Step your right foot forward, stay on the ball of the back foot. Come up onto the fingertips, look forward. Keep the back leg firm and strong and squeeze your hips down. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, put your left knee down onto the floor. Point your toes away. Place both hands onto your right knee. You're gonna straighten the right leg just a little bit and square off your hips. Then slowly begin to bend that knee again without arching the back. And inhale, arms reach over your head. Hold and breathe. Exhale, both hands down. And you're gonna step back into downward facing dog. Left foot forwards down the ball of the right foot. Stay up onto the fingertips. Sternum forward, back leg straight and strong. Breathe. Put your right knee on the floor, point your toes away. Both hands onto the left knee. Straighten the left leg a little bit as you square off the hips. Keeping that tailbone in, bend that left knee a little deeper. Then inhale, bring your arms up over your head. Exhale, both hands down onto the floor. Curl the back toes under and step back into downward facing dog. Now from here, you're gonna step your right foot way between your hands, turn your back foot flat. Pressing into both feet, bring your hands onto your hips, preparing for warrior one. Square off the hips. Take the tailbone in, bend the knee. And inhale, bring both arms up over your head. Look up and breathe. Exhale, both hands down, and step back into downward facing dog. Switch sides. Left foot forward, back foot flat. Pressing into the feet. First, bring your hands onto your hips. Stabilize the pose. Organize the pelvis by rotating that right hip forward. Bend the left knee deeper. Inhale, arms reach. Hold and breathe. Exhale, both hands down, and step back into Downward Facing Dog. Stretch it way back. And walk your feet to your hands. 
Inhale, look up. Exhale, fold. Chair position. Bend your knees and drop your hips. And you're gonna inhale, bring both arms up over your head. Sinking your hips just a little bit lower, take the tailbone away from the kidneys. Exhale to stand, and palms right at the heart. Take a breath. You're gonna step open to your side, feet wide, about five feet apart. Turn your right foot out and your left toes in, preparing for triangle pose. Keeping both legs straight, you're gonna inhale, the arms are gonna come out to the sides. Hinge at your right hip, right hand onto the shin or the ankle, or if you need to use a block to the side of the foot, that's fine. Bring that left arm up and breathe. Ground, lengthen, energize. Look down and inhale to stand. Turn the right foot in, the left foot out. Establish the pose, keeping the legs straight. Inhale, exhale, lengthen through the left side of the body, the hand on the shin or ankle, right arm straight up to the ceiling. Try to find length and space along the left side of the body. Both shoulders pulling down the back. Energize the upper arm. Look down, inhale to stand. Left foot turns in, hands onto the hips. Take a breath. Spin your right foot out, your left foot in. Make sure you're heel to arch. Inhale, arms out to the sides, and exhale, come into warrior two. Push firmly into the outside edge of that left foot as you squeeze your right knee open. Keep your face soft. Inhale, straighten the leg. Turn the right foot in, left foot out. Deep breath in. Exhale and bend. Bone under the left big toe, press it down. Squeeze the left knee open. Breathe. Straighten the left leg. Turn the left foot in, hands onto the hips. Take another deep breath. And then arms out to the sides. Spin your right foot out, your left foot in. Bend your right knee and balance the right forearm on the thigh, left hand to the hip. Inhale, bring your left arm out over the ear. Keep the inner ankle of your left foot lifted so you don't collapse into the ankle or the knee joint. Inhale, come back into warrior two, then straighten the leg and switch sides. Left foot turns out, right foot in, deep breath in. Exhale, bend the knee, balance the left forearm, right hand onto the hip. Hold here as you squeeze that left knee open, then reach the right arm out over the right ear, lengthening through the whole right side of your body. Breathe deep. Inhale, come on up, slowly straighten the leg. Turn your left foot in, hands onto the hips. Inhale, lift your chest, and exhale, fold. Put your fingertips onto the floor. You're just gonna simply inhale, lengthen the chest, and you may need to stay here. Or, if you can, you're gonna bend your elbows, grab hold of the big toes. And again, you're gonna look forward and lengthen, and exhale, top of the head down, and breathe. Inhale, look up. You're gonna bring your fingertips all the way together so your thumbs are touching. Put your right hand onto your lower back. Squaring off the hips, inhale, open the right chest towards the ceiling, then bring your right arm straight up. Both shoulders pulling down the back and breathe. Exhale, the right hand down. Put your left hand onto your lower back. Keep the hips level. Then inhale, open your left chest, twisting in the middle of the spine, 
You bring your left arm straight upward. Look to the left arm if you can. If it hurts the neck, you look down. Exhale, both hands down onto the floor. You're gonna separate the hands and then inhale, look up. Exhale and fold. Walk your hands between your legs if it's possible. Press the elbows in, lift the shoulders away from the neck, and breathe. Inhale, look up. Hands onto the hips as you exhale, and then inhale to stand. Turn your right foot out, step your back foot in a little bit, square off the hips, Take a very deep breath in. Exhale and fold, putting both hands onto the floor, preparing for twisting triangle. Make sure you're heel to heel. The right leg is straight and you're gonna inhale, lengthen the spine and bring your right arm straight up to the ceiling. You can always put your left hand onto a block, but make sure you stay up onto your fingertips. Pull the sternum forward as that right hip pulls back. Then exhale, both hands down. Hands onto the hips. Inhale to stand. Switch sides. Make sure you're heel to heel. Hips aligned. Inhale and exhale, put your hands onto the floor. Square off the hips again, lengthen through the left side of the body. Then keeping the right fingertips onto the floor, bring your left arm straight upward and breathe. Press firmly into the feet as the thighs lift. Sternum pulling forward as the shoulders pull down the back. Both hands down as you exhale and then hands onto the hips. Inhale to stand. Turn your left foot in, palms into namaste. Take a deep breath in and then exhale, step to the front of the mat. Hold. Center. And inhale, arms reach. Exhale, fold all the way forward. Inhale, lengthen the spine. And exhale, step back, top of a push-up. And lower down, Chaturanga Dandasana. Inhale, upward facing dog, open the heart. And exhale, downward facing dog. Step your right foot forward and stay on the ball of the back foot. Keep your left fingertips down onto the floor. And then inhale, bring your right arm up, pull the heart forward and breathe. Exhale, both hands down. Step back into push-up position and lower. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Step your left foot forward, stay on the ball of the back foot. Stay on to your right fingertips and inhale, the left arm straight up, opening the chest. Squeeze the hips down as you pull the sternum long and breathe. Exhale, both hands down. Step back into push-up position and lower. Inhale, press into upward facing dog. And exhale, downward facing dog. Take a very deep breath as you stretch it back. And then come down onto your knees, sit your butt back onto your heels, lift your spine. Then you're gonna shift your weight to the side and we're gonna move towards half Navasana. So soles of the feet on the floor. Bring your fingertips to the ground and lift your feet up. Your feet and knees on the same line. Extend your arms alongside the shins and breathe. Bring your feet back to the floor. Inhale, lift your chest. Exhale it out. And let's do this again. So balancing on your sit bones, extend the arms alongside the shins 
and then straighten your legs for full boat pose if possible. Breathe. Come back into half boat and then put the feet on the floor, lift your spine and roll all the way out onto the floor. Take a breath. Separate the feet hips width apart, knees are bent. Inhale, lift your hips as you come into bridge. You're gonna interlace your fingers underneath you, press the forearms down, push into the feet and press the rib cage towards the jaw and breathe. Exhale, lower it all the way down. Separate your feet, mats width apart, let the knees drop in, take a breath. Let's do this again, separate the feet hips width apart. This time grab your heels or your ankles. Pushing into the feet, inhale, lift your hips. Get your shoulders underneath you and press down and lift your chest towards your jaw and breathe. Exhale, lower it all the way down. Separate the feet, let the knees drop in and breathe. One more time. Bring your feet closer together, hips width apart. Press down. Come up onto the balls of the feet and support your lower back with your hands. Elbows and shoulders on the same line. Then press your heels back downward towards the floor. Breathe deeply as the tailbone lengthens towards the underbelly of your knees. And release it. Squeeze your knees into your chest and take a very deep breath in. And as you exhale, you're gonna drop your knees over to your left and reach the right arm out. Look towards the right hand, flex your feet, Lift your shins up off the floor, arch your back, and draw the right shoulder down onto the ground. Notice how your body feels. Squeeze both knees into your chest. Drop your knees over to the right and reach the left arm out. Flex your feet and lift the shins up off the floor. Arch your back and then let your left shoulder pull down onto the ground as you bring your spine back into balance. Squeeze both knees into your chest. Cross your right ankle above your left knee. Reach between and clasp hold of either the back of the thigh or the front of the shin. Allow your right knee to draw forward as your left knee pulls in. Relax your mouth and your eyes. Focus on the sensation. Switch sides. Cross your left ankle above the right knee. Reach between and grab hold. Gently pull your right knee in. And breathe. Releasing the leg, squeeze both knees back into your chest. Take a very deep breath in. Exhale it out. And you're gonna roll to your side and sit on up. You're gonna come into staff pose. So extend your legs straight out in front of you. You're gonna reach underneath your buttocks and pull the flesh back. And then put your hands alongside your hips. Hold here with a long spine and take a deep breath in. Bending your right knee, place the right foot onto the floor to the inside of the thigh. Bring your left hand across the right shin and the right hand behind you, and then look out towards the right shoulder and breathe. Exhale, face forward, extend the right leg forward and switch sides. Left foot down, right arm crosses in front, left arm behind you. Inhale, lift. 
exhale and twist. Exhale, face forward. Extend that left leg forward, come back into staff pose. Deep breath in. Then exhale, place the right foot to the inside of the left thigh. Put both hands onto the floor on either side of your left leg. Inhale, lengthen. Hold here as you exhale. Keep the spine long. And only if you have more flexibility in that left leg can you begin to walk your hands forward and fold into the straight left leg and breathe. Inhale, come on up. And switch sides. Put your left foot to the inside of the thigh. Both hands onto the floor. Inhale, lengthen. Walk your hands forward, keeping the integrity of the spine. And only if you have more flexibility do you want to walk your hands forward and fold into your right leg. Grabbing whatever you can. Close your eyes and breathe. Inhale, come on up. Come back into staff pose, lifting and lengthening the spine. And then you're gonna come into Baddha Konasana, so bring the soles of the feet together and let the knees drop open. Hold onto the feet and roll the feet open. Hold here for a moment with the spine nice and straight, the hips relaxing. Take another deep breath in, and then as you exhale, just come part way. Hold. Listen to your body. Only go deeper if it feels appropriate. Inhale, come up, bring the knees together. Extend both legs straight out in front of you. Inhale, arms reach. Exhale and fold. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale and if it's possible, you're gonna walk your hands forward, grab the feet, Lengthen the sternum, fold and close your eyes. Be absolutely present. Inhale, come on up. And from here, Gonna roll all the way out, one vertebra at a time, and find your way into Shavasana, into resting pose. Extend your legs away from the lumbar spine and draw the shoulders away from the neck. Close your eyes. Relax your mouth. Soften the shoulders. The arms. Your hands. Relax your chest and any tension in your belly. Allowing all of your systems to come back into balance, into harmony, grounded, soft, each exhale drawing you down into the earth beneath you. Relax your hips. In your thighs, energy draining, softening, your feet and toes, 
Let everything go in this moment. Let it all go. And rest. Bringing your attention back to your breath. Inhale. And then reach your arms up over your head and get a good stretch. Bring yourself back into the space. Squeeze your knees into your chest. You're going to roll to your right side and sit on up. And come into a cross-legged position. Sitting up as tall as you can, wrists onto your knees, breathe. Yoga releases the physical and emotional tensions and toxins so that we can sit in meditation for longer periods of time without distraction or discomfort. Sitting, being, reminds us that beyond the body, in the vast landscape of our imagination and mind, there exists a knowing that calls us home to the truth of our soul. We are all connected. Heaven and earth, mind and body, you and I. We cleanse the resistance, the fear, the anger, the grief, so that we can be present to the truth within and know that we are one. Place your palms into namaste. Together we give thanks for all the gifts in our life, for the food that we eat, the air that we breathe, and this remarkable planet that supports and sustains us. We ask for the mindfulness to make healthier and more conscious choices and to continue to purify ourselves of the tension, toxins, and perceptions that no longer serve our health or happiness. May our hearts open to know love, and may that love guide us into the depths of our deepest joy. May that joy be peace, and may this peace unite the essence of each moment, every breath, and all beings as one. Namaste. Namaste.